Um, I'm just doing this real quick. I'm about to put away a bunch of uh, reels in the case. And while I had them all out and open, I wanted to just show you guys them so you can take a look. Um, my boy Brucey Kowalski just stopped in. He just got off the lake walleye fishing. He, uh, he said he bailed a bunch. So um, the walleye are biting. Uh, I got some really cool new lures. I got a whole bunch of uh, yell eyes. If you guys haven't tried those yet, they're absolutely incredible. The Rapala bite has been unbelievable. What I got here in this picture is some incredible new cork from our people in Portugal. You can see it's actually like infused with some different types of material. Um, and then uh, it's pressed and heated so it really locks in there. We're going to really focus on our cork uh, business coming up for 2022 and 2023. So if you guys are building rods and you want some really neat cork, get at me. I'll totally hook you up. Um, as far as reels go, uh, we are getting this new building I'm super excited about it. If you guys could be so kind, if you need a reel, um, right now would be the time to buy. I'm doing 10% off, um, non-custom orders, and um, it's basically like, you know, you're making a donation to the sh** and uh, you're getting a reel out of the deal. But I want to walk you through. This is a Joker fade for Don Henry, who makes hook jaw floats. Here I have a really beautiful drop back with Michigan artwork on the back. It's a 5-inch. What's up, Patrick? Um, guys, Pat is making us some custom rod, uh, or not rod ties, but sorry, excuse me, I'm exhausted. But uh, bait caddy, bait holders, kind of like a bait pal. Um, and some cool colors, so we got that coming pretty soon. Keep your eye out. We're going to be able to use the chrome tainers in Pat's design. Um, I got this really beautiful uh, um, Canada trout artwork with a blurple, uh, blurple speckle um, aqua wash on the front. Let's see, oh, uh, this reel is a custom. It's a toxic custom for Tyson Tinker. I'll have to send Tyson a photo when I get off with you guys. Um, I have a couple new mini pins, another blurple one there. It's just my signature on the back. Really nice looking reel. This one's an absolute beauty. This is a gun metal with silver trim with... Um, Chola cactus handles and it's got the Michigan on the back this reel is actually called the sack fry it's got uh, one of Tony's creation it's supposed to look like a bunch of eggs and then an, an egg with the hook going through it and that's got the sack fry artwork on the back um, I do have a monsoon right here. This is a 595 all red trimmed in bronze with the dripping steel artwork on the back. I got this beauty red velvet with a black back plate, dripping steel on the back. I got this insane atomic autumn with the stone zipper on the back. I have a New York State artwork, Dreamcatcher 395. I have this beautiful hard coat red velvet on red velvet with uh, the new stung steel artwork from Trevor Hawkins. And you can see how much that art just pops on this reel. I mean, what a gem. And that's a 535. This one here is Oregon Candy Apple Green, bronze backplate with the Sequoia artwork. Let's see what I got in here. Reel for Matt Olson. This one is available. If you want something really wild, check out this. Blue and pink acid wash with the black backplate with the seamstress on it. $5.95, that is a slammer. 
Here's another nice one. It's Atomic Autumn with the Michigan artwork on the back. Uh, this is a reel that I actually traded somebody for. My buddy Matt Olson bought it. And he actually traded it back to me for a couple reels or for a reel. So super excited to get that back in my collection. I got a black on black drop back for my boy Danny Cohen. I don't want to ruin any more surprises. So I should probably stop opening these. But yeah, that's what I got. Case is fully stocked. If you guys don't know, I am doing a mini pin competition. It's going to go from June 1st to September 31st. Um, if there is 31 days in September, I don't even know right now. I'm so exhausted. But uh, basically, with your mini pin, we're doing three categories and we're doing three big prizes. The first prize, what up, Steve? Um, we're doing the first prize is going to be a, um, I shouldn't even say first, second, and third because what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a lottery after the tournament's over. So there's going to be three entries that you can enter, and you have to use a Colville CPR. 395 or 4.24 inch and the first um the ghost in here is moving around i just heard it but anyways the first category is the largest non-migratory trout the second um entry is the most unique catch on the center pin and then the third category is the largest overall fish of any species caught on the mini pin so you have to use a 395 or a 4.24 inch if you go on our pinlin page or uh Pinlin mini center pin long distance nymphing page. You'll be able to see the contest and kind of see what we're doing. And I think it's going to be really fun. Uh, the prizes are going to be uh, we're doing a center pin with the Pinlin um, mini pin challenge 2022 on it. Uh, we're doing a blood run um, rod and then we're doing a whole prize pack that's going to have some voodoo jigs in it, some hook jaw floats, some um, uh, tar hat, and I'm sure we'll get some other sponsors along the way. So I'm excited to, uh, to bring this out, and I hope I get a bunch of people participating. Um, all the rules, the breakdown of the rules are all on Facebook on the mini pin page so you guys got to go to that and you got to see what it's all about because I love to have you guys um, participate in that it's going to be a really cool thing and I plan on doing it yearly so uh, if you guys could think of anything that will help this tournament go smoother let me know um, I, I you know it's the first one I'm doing uh, the other thing, too, is um, if you guys are looking for any sort of loan or mortgages or anything, you guys have to check out Cattaraugus County Bank. They have absolutely been a godsend through this whole process of me getting this other building. Um, they're really incredible people to work with. They really do care about the community. They care about the people. There's a lot of banks that will promise you up and down, oh, yeah, we want, we care about the community. We want to do what's best for the community. All they care about is filling their pockets. Even your mortgage company that you've been dealing with for 30 years our 25 years will still try to burn you. Um, I'm absolutely disappointed. But Cataraugus Community Bank, you guys need to check them out. They're unbelievable. If you're looking for a good lawyer and you're in western New York, there's no better one than Atia and Atia in Hamburg. They're the they're legit. They really are. But Cataraugus County Bank.
Um, okay, I'm going to show you guys some lures, too. Um, we did just get a whole entire... A whole entire box of all kinds of goodies. Some Spro terminal boxes, some planer boards, some clevises. But look at these, guys. These are where it's at. Scatter wraps. These are hard to get. But, uh, yeah, so there's scatter wraps here. All kinds of good stuff. So, the walleye's kicking off. If you guys could, come and get your stuff here. We're going to be moving in the next couple months. So, I want to clear this place out while still making sure I have enough stuff for everybody. But, uh, if you want to reel, now's the time to buy. And if you want to enter the competition, you got to get yourself one of these little mini pins. But, uh... All right, I'm going to bed, guys. I am exhausted. I love y'all. Hope you guys uh, have a great day tomorrow and a good sleep tonight. All right, much love. Peace, guys.